Hi everyone, this is Jason Zak from Nathaniel. In this lesson, we are going to learn See You Again, the intro part by Charlie Puth. It's an incredible piano intro. The chords are voiced beautifully. Simple though, very easy to learn, but a few minor things which may cause your ears or your mind to get a little bit uh, confused, if you will. So what I like to do in most of my videos is explain the chords, give you the theory background of the song. So I've learned this song by listening to the original version, of course. So for the most part, it's going to sound exactly like this. So stick around, learn it exactly the way I'm telling you and then AB it with the song. I think it should sound absolutely the same way. So the song is on B flat major, two flats. <laughs> B flat, the name of the scale, and E flat, the fourth. Okay, so good to know. And the chords used in the song, just to just for your information. So the chords there are. Da, 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 da. That's B flat major. So G minor seventh, B flat major, do, 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 do. E flat major, B flat, da, da, de, 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 de. end on F major and then repeat. Do, 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 do. De, 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 do. E flat major going to B flat. So I've put down the chords as well in the transcript downloadable on our Patreon as a PDF. So do consider getting yourself a copy of the PDF and my notes on Patreon as usual, just like all of our lessons which we do on our YouTube channel. Right, so let's get cracking. Line one, let me play it and then show you. So the intro can be divided into two lines. Second line. So let's learn this song line by line. Let's start with the first line. I'll play it and then teach it in a slower and break it down properly. Okay. Okay, what's going on there? Let's only look at the right hand first. Just the first bar he goes, he stacks the F with C and then move the thumb to D. So now try to keep these three fingers ready for those. One more time. Okay, let's break that up. Only that. One more time. Alright. Slightly tricky if your pinky has not been used that much. Whole intro, line one, and now he goes, and then it's simple F C B flat F, da 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 da. So that pretty much repeats almost all the time. So that's the treble clef for the right hand for line one. Now that we've got the right hand for line one, let's focus our attention to the left hand. So we start with just single roots, just a sing single G and then a single B flat. That's pretty much what we do there because the double stops anyways coming from the right hand. So then B flat over D, you can even ring everything or hold the pedal. See, I'm not lifting my hand from the notes. You don't need to. In fact, it all together sounds great. Now, let's move forward. G, B flat. Now, now you do some chords which are 
E flat inverted, E flat fifth inverted, so B flat, E flat in the left hand. So you just essentially do B flat, E flat, and then slide this E flat to F. Just that. Again. Now what he does is he goes an entire triad finally, which is CFA and F major in the second inversion. So G, sorry, I forgot to play that double stop there again. Okay, so C over F, C with F rather, G in the bass. Now, E flat with B flat in the bass. B. Now B flat fifth, triad, triad, CFA. Okay, whole intro. That was just line one rather. We'll come to the second line. It's really easy. Hope you've got this. Let's slow it down a bit. So the right hand stays ridiculously simple for the, the latter or the second line of the composition. So you pivot this F. Earlier we did some Ds. We don't have to do that for the second half. Da 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 da. And then it's pretty much it. While the left hand does a little bit of different stuff at the line two, you just do fifth chord. So that's G fifth, B flat, E flat, lower, and it just ends with a very very mellow B flat fifth. Second line. All fifth chords in the second line in the left hand again. Both lines, let's give it a go. Mm. D chord, full chord, fifths, fifths, fifths. Slow that down even more. Mm. Just remember the first line, the first G and B flat are single. You have to remember that. G to B flat. Lick. Chord. Chord. Triad. That's the F passing. Then fifth chords. Fifth chords. Okay, whole story now. Okay, slightly faster now. happy to finish off the song as well if you want me to finish the entire lesson do leave a, uh, a comment and uh, don't forget to like the video share the video give it a thumbs up etc hit the subscribe if you haven't already get yourself a copy of the notation it's very intricate uh, even i find it very difficult to remember all the ingredients which he plays on the piano there's a lot to it so you may want to get yourself a copy of the notation to supplement the video Right guys, again this is Jason Zach from Nathaniel, stay safe, cheers.